Rank 6. How pathetic. Right. Oh well. But how am I supposed to gain the trust of my employees? I'm not great at public speaking and even just giving my opinion makes me a little nervous. Haru? Is that her fiance? Yep. Sugimura so, san, what are you doing here? I was just heading home from a business en engagement when I saw you from my car window. Hmm, do I know you from somewhere? You're one of those bats brats from before. Um. This is a friend from school, he's helping me look for some books today. Anyway, we should be getting back to our shopping, please excuse us. Hold on Haru, you think you can go on a date with another man and leave your fiancé in the dust? You are not my fiancé, I already said I'm not going to marry you. Oh yeah? And what about the contract I made with your father? Your father is no longer here, besides marriage is something that you go into with your own free will. The contract could never hold the same weight. You sure about that? Think about the reparation reparations clause. If you back out of the deal now, you will lose everything you own, Okamura Foods, your estate. Even so. And what about your employees? Are you really willing to put their jobs on the line for the, the sake of your own selfishness? Besides, this marriage is exactly what Okamura Foods needs right now. My father would have no trouble managing your shares or sweeping away your company's tarnished image. That reminds me, did Takakura-san tell you about the wedding hall? He got us the Phoenix Wing at the Wilton. He made a provisional reservation for 10 days this coming spring. After all, the sooner the better. Well, wait a minute. We'll have to look into our guest schedules as well. There'll be over three, 300 of them, you know. Takakura-san can handle Okamura Foods in the meantime. Why don't you go stop by the gym or something, Haru? I mean, if you have time to mess around with this punk, you damn well have time to get a little thinner. I'm out of here. What a dick. I'm sorry about that. That guy is horrible. Um. You're not wrong about that. He has everything. Fame, intelligence, manners. The only thing he needs now is a wife he can control. And I guess I'm the perfect target. He's going to get Okamura Foods as well as my entire inheritance and I'm totally pow powerless against him. Be strong. You're right, I can't afford to drag myself down with such negativity. Thank you. Um. Anyway, I hope I can share, share with you again some other time. For today, though, I'm rather tired. Would it be okay if we parted here? I suppose. Goodbye. See ya. I really hope I have time to do stuff at night. Because if I don't, that's just going to be an annoyance. I just hope it doesn't auto-play out. It doesn't. Something should have happened by now. Uh oh. Congratulations on getting through exams, everyone. Congrats. It's finally over. I'm worried about the end result, though. You did. You all did your best. I'm sure you'll be fine. You should have studied all your subjects, though, instead of trying to guess what's on the exam. There's no way I can do that. Ah, the cry of desperation. Exams aside, I heard back from my sister. There's been some progress. She'll be interrogating Shido soon. She also apologizes for the wait and promises she will manage to build the case against him. I can't wait to see what kind of news it makes. Why don't we take the opportunity to go out on the town tomorrow? Let's meet in Shibuya at noon and forget about our exams. Yeah, screw exams. Agreed. Well, I'm gonna make like a tree and get, get out of here for now. See ya. There we go. I should, maybe, be able to max out Oya somehow. Like through some miracle. Church today, no point. I swear, I'm gonna end up going to see what's her face, aren't I? Like, I'll see Chihaya, and she still won't give me enough with Oya to max her out. I can already tell. Yeah. And the fact that that ca could be the case absolutely sucks. Hmm. Oh, please brace myself. Please take a seat. What shall we do? Uh, an affinity reading. Oh yeah. I really hope this works. Yeah, I do. Ah, my fortune read. 
Oh dear. I'm really worried. I'm really just like, this isn't gonna work, is it? Ah! Uh. Right there. What do you think? Has it worked? Yes! Oh my god, I actually managed to max her out. Yay! Hifumi would have been interesting to see what she said, but no worries. I would say Oya's more interesting, only for the fact that she's a journalist, so I'm curious as to how she'll react. Well, she'll she'll know that we are the um, the leader of the Phantom Thieves. So I'm just curious as to what the hell happens and what she says. So I have to take this just a minute. This should all be voiced, so we should be okay. Yep, replace the previous article. No worries, right? Might as well go all out if we're gonna do this. I'm gonna scrap the others and rewrite them as well. Yep, tomorrow morning then. Sorry, that was the chief. Ah, you two are on good terms? He's been great. He's ignoring the higher-ups' orders to help me. Oh, wow. I'm doing a special expose on the Phantom Thieves, and the Chief's helping me. Mm. It's about their origin and the root of the problem they're trying to solve. I think it really captures the spirit of journalism. Hmm. Is that entertainment? Making it seem like entertainment while conveying serious news is the beauty of it, no? We need people to pick the issue up first so we can hit them with the truth. Mm. The higher-ups were against it. But this expose has been very popular with our readers. Since we've sold so many copies, there's nothing they can do about it. Or us. Or oh, us. Yes. We're planning to throw in additional articles while we have the chance. Ah. I'm glad to hear that. This is only just the beginning, though. Alright! Let's have a victory celebration! Lala-chan, I hope you have some dumb Perignon for us. I told you last time, we don't have any of that here. That's what I figured. So, I reserved a bottle at the wine shop. Huh. <laughs> okay, I'll go get it for you. Oh my. Impressive. Looks like Lala-chan took the hint. Mm -hmm. I wanted to speak with you. In private. Oh. Okay, I'm happy to talk. I'll loosen up a bit, will ya? I've been quietly making preparations to write a story about Shido's confidant, too. Going to uncover the truth. I swear to Kayo. Thanks. Again. Whenever I felt like giving up, you encouraged me to keep going. It's all thanks to you that I was able to get this far. Mr. Phantom Thief. Hey! The Chief's change of heart happened exactly the same way as those other cases. And the timing was absolutely perfect. You're the only one who could have orchestrated all that. Lana, so you knew all along? It was so obvious. Damn. I'm convinced from all the recent coverage that the Phantom Thieves truly are valiant. Helping the weak. Punishing the bad. They actually do all those things. In a sense, you and I have the same objective. We both want to expose the ills of society. So, I won't tell anyone about your true identity. Let's form a united front to fight evil. Mm. If it weren't for you, I never would have been able to return to my journalist self. True. My high schooler source who manipulated information ended up manipulating my heart too. I'm going to return the favor one of these days, all right? <laughs> Until then, we'll race to see who can expose evil first. Hmm. There we are. We have our blood oath. Oh my god, I actually managed to max I her out. Thou, thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a So the only ones I didn't manage to get was Haru shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Haru Hifumi and Hawaii. Of the devil, granting thee infinite power. I'm also Empress. Empress, Star, and Hang are the three that I haven't managed to get. But oh well. Alright. 
I was so close. All right. It truly is a bit of a shame that I'm not. I don't get chance. Anyway, where the hell is Lala Chan? Shall we get started then? Considering we're already in a celebratory mood. Hmm. I wonder if you'll make it back home tonight. I'm gonna have you stick around till the very end. Great. I will not accept your refusal. Ew. Refusal. Oh my god, I am so shocked. No, not the fact that she knew. Every confidant knows once you max them out. I'm just shocked at the fact that she can't. Um, that I managed to max her out. I was certain that I wasn't going to be able to max anybody else out. Something's not right. The Phantom Aficionado website isn't busy at all. This doesn't make sense. Why? I mean, Masayo Shishiro got taken down. People should be posting comments left r left and right about this. The silence makes no sense at all. Is it... Oh god. Is it because it hasn't made the news? It's so obvious the Phantom Thieves are responsible though. Fucking hiccups. Oh, it's the worst. So my heart wants to burst out my chest. Yeah, it keeps... It's dropping even further. That is weird. It's almost Christmas. What is it we're doing? Oh yeah. The news is talking about how Shido won in a landslide. By a landslide. ...announced the poor health of their leader, Masayoshi Shido. As such, the special diet session was postponed, along with Shido's inauguration as Prime Minister. Postponed? They should be firing him! And wait, poor health? This is completely different from what my sister told us. I heard he barely slept during the election campaign. I don't blame him. He's not going to step down now, is he? Will this country be fine without Shido? How can people still believe in him? What the heck? The Phantom Thieves are being treated like, well, like they never existed. Hmm? Goodness. No link among the change of heart instants. Only coincidental psychiatric disorders. The Phantom Thieves only use those rumors to their advantage. This is preposterous. Who would believe such things? Everybody is believing it. The saying this is a famous researcher. And even the Ministry is saying that's how they determined the situation too. When's Shido gonna make a comeback? Honestly, I don't think anyone else but Shido can handle times like these. What's going on? No matter how you look at it, this isn't normal. Nope. Yeah, it's as if the people in reality have become distorted. What's happening here worries me. But the only thing we can do right now is wait and see what happens. Hmm. That's really weird. So the Phantom Thieves are being made to see. What do you mean I can't question him at this point? Made to look as if they didn't Mr. do anything. Shido is in an extremely unstable state. I can't allow you to get in contact with him. He may officially have to undergo a psychiatric evaluation at this rate. We are at the cusp of making a case. Do you know how much trouble we've gone through to get this far? I'm just doing my job as a doctor. Even if Shido was behind it, do you plan on convicting a central figure behind such a historical change? What? Don't be ridiculous. This is a country governed by law. You still want to protect him, even though you know what happened to the man previously at your post. So, you plan on taking the head of the nation to court. You need to take a break, Nijima. I'm taking you off this case, especially since it's rumored you have ties to the Phantom Thieves. What? If I recall correctly, you still aren't married, are you? You'll be on leave for a long time. Why not look for a husband while you're at it? The hell? Wow, that's stupid. Yeah, what on earth? What has happened to the world? It's like everyone's brainwashed. The assembly of Shido's case is in danger? We know he doesn't need a psychiatric evaluation! His lackeys must have pressured the others around him. It means there's far more people who'd be in trouble if the truth came out than we imagined. 
Isn't there anything we can do? Sis said that the assembly for a case may be possible if the general public wants Shido accountable. But even that chance has been destroyed with the manipulation of the mass media. They mm. made it clear that the argument itself was a cult, even claiming that it never happened. As a result, the Phantom Thieves are still labeled as criminals, even after all that's happened. It's a storm of criticisms online, too. People are saying to catch the remnants and execute them. This is crazy. Mm. At any rate, let's wait for my sister. She should be arriving here soon. Everyone's being tricked so easily. Why the hell did we risk our lives then? If Shido isn't judged by the law, everything we've done will be treated as if it never happened. Moving the entire country however they wish by controlling people's cognition? This is no different than being inside a palace. Mm. I'm sorry. I gathered the best of the best and fought for a case. But as Makoto must have told you, it was denied. At this rate, it won't end with just Shido's innocence. This trend will continue spiraling down. Mm -hmm. There's even the possibility that crimes using the metaverse will advance onto a national scale. But that's not what I'm here to tell you. We're in danger because we know the truth. It's only a matter of time before we're apprehended. It wouldn't be odd if they were to charge in now. Mm. This makes no effing sense! Sis! There's nothing more I can do with my resources. That's why... I want to ask for your help. I wondered if there was any way you could do something one last time. I know that I'm in no position to ask this of you. That doesn't matter to us. So what are we gonna do? Should we change the hearts of all Shido's followers? Even if Futaba were to research all of them, it'd take time. Yeah. There's too little information. We can only target individuals. Are we no match against the national power? Mementos. Hmm? If we use Mementos, we might be able to do something. There's something we can do there? Oh yeah, that's the, the heart yeah, of the public. Mementos is the palace of the general public. Mm. It's the source of all distortions, and is maintained by the people's collective unconsciousness. Wait, do you mean that there's a treasure even in Mementos? Well, and yeah. We go after that. The collapse of Mementos should affect the public as a whole. The state of society would change too. If everyone's hearts grow to hold Shido responsible for his actions, things might start going our way. Mm. That's a bold plan, but an interesting one. Sounds good to me! But if we're gonna do this, there's one thing you all need to realize. To begin with, why does something like the human cognition exist as another substantial world? The reason for that is most likely sleeping within mementos. Right. We're destroying that, you know. I don't see where you're going with this. The human cognition will lose substance, so you can't sneak into people's palaces anymore. Oh. Uh -oh. So if other criminals appear, you won't be able to steal their treasure and change their hearts. Uh oh. That means the phantom thieves will be going out of business. Aww. That's she. We'll have to discard this way of life. No. We have no choice. I think we need to do this. I mean, we're the group who's reforming society, right? Mm-hmm. What do you think? As our leader, you lose your powers if Mementos is erased. Will you still do it? Yes, for our justice. Yeah, that's right. You guys have all grown, huh? Uh huh. Right. We have no choice either. No either way. Did you come up with a plan? Whether it succeeds or not is another story, though. Hmm. Miss Prosecutor, looks like this is gonna be our last job. Last job? We're erasing the metaverse. Once we accomplish our duty, 
We entrust the world to respectful adults. That is our condition for accepting this job. This is a deal, then. That's certainly a heavy condition. Mm -hmm. Very well. I accept. I swear to make Masayo Shishido stand and be tried in the court of law. Yay! Besides, my pride won't allow me to be continually saved by you all without doing anything in return. <laughs> we'll be counting on you. Yeah, more than you know. Looks like it's decided then. Yep. You're the leader, and this is officially our last mission. Come on, say something. Let's fix this country. We already said that before, though. <laughs> That's fine. Huh. We're doing it for real this time, after all. Yep. We don't have much time, right? We should carry this out tomorrow. I'm counting on you guys. And this is the only palace where you yeah, literally what have. You better see it through. Well, you only have a single day to actually get through it. It's not like r a regular palace where you can leave and come back. This one you have to do in one go. Tomorrow's the big battle. Better get some serious rest. Yeah, days until re-arrest. Phew. Yeah, I can't make any lockpicks, but thankfully I don't think I need any. Yep. Let's go. Good night. Oh, dearie me. Hey. Actually, never mind. You must be tired. What's up, dude? What's up? Honestly, you're amazing. There's definitely something special about you. Hm. You dodge everything the enemies throw at you like it's your destiny. At first, I just thought you were going to be a useful tool for me. But now, this is where I belong. Stay here forever. Aren't you only going to be here for a year? Still, it makes me happy to hear that. It's not like me to say all that embarrassing stuff. But still, huh. I think it's fine. For tonight, at least. It's a sh oh, nice! Of course. Morgana's maxed out, too. Blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the magician, granting thee infinite power. There it is. What does Zoro turn into? Oh, I didn't see what that turned that into. Oh well. Whoa. A new power burns within me. Hmm. All right. It turned him into Mercurius. Holy crap. That one looks badass. Evade Alec. No thanks. Look at him. Jesus. We should rest in preparation for tomorrow. Yeah, you don't say. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. God damn, I fall asleep so easy. Wow, sleeping in so literally five such seconds. A deal, and this guy's still not being rewarded for it. Hmm. If gods really do exist, they're being too hard on him. Ah. Ah. Oh. Going to see my buddy Igor. 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 Big nose. Isn't, that's one of his nicknames, isn't it? Man with really long nose, or man with long nose. I think so. That was a fruitless delight, inmate. Jesus. We gave you words of praise, but we take them all back. What? The source of what was hindering your rehabilitation. To think it would be the ignorant masses to which you tried to prove your integrity. Did they themselves not show elation for those who are unseen? Despite all that, they now say you do not exist. They toyed with you, yet none take responsibility. 
The distortion of man's world is endlessly deep. Fixing it may now be impossible, Oof. even with the appearance of a trickster. M master <gasps> It seems this is the limit of humanity. Mm -hmm. What are you saying? The time of ruin is nigh. One due to the distortion of man's own heart from which none can escape. <sighs> mm -hmm. All right. Lovely. Hmm. It seems we are disappearing. Lost my will to live. I'm just like, so what? Oh. The last big heist for the Phantom Thieves. You and everyone else, you've all grown so much. No, this is not time to get sentimental. We're going to end this on a bang. All right, let's go. Good morning. It's finally time. You think it'll go well? It has to. Let's do this. It's something only we can do. See, see you at the usual place after school. I'll tell everyone to come. We're just gonna go straight into mementos, or what? Hmm. Oh, our grades came out in a day. I'm top of the class. Damn. Not bad. Top of the class. Oh yeah. Very nice. Either way. Are we just going straight to mementos, or... Oh, there we are. Hey, check out the nav. It's displaying an unfamiliar message. The door to the depths of mementos has been opened. Wait, does that mean... We're really gonna do this, right? Mm-hmm. Of course. Why are you asking now? Well, I, I just thought, what am I going to do if you guys freak out and bail on me? We're going to erase mementos, aren't we? Come on, let's go, you guys. You got it. Mona sure seems hyped up. There he goes. Say, isn't Mona-chan behaving a little odd? Mm. You know, you're right. I think I know why. Well, he's dream he's had a dream. That up. Shall we get going? He's had a dream like three or four times of him appearing in mementos as a shadow. Or with with yellow eyes. Why on earth are we doing this? No 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 no. For reals? Something different in here, I can't sense any targets. This never happened, not even in a palace. This is perfect, we don't got Time to be dealing with those weak dudes anyway. Fewer hindrances on our descent, the better. Yeah, go to a higher area. Yeah, I want to go back to the entrance and then fast travel all the way down to the bottom. Why would I not do that? That would be foolish. There we go, all the way to the bottom. This is like floor 66, isn't it? We made it, I'll let you decide what what we do going forward, Joker? Oh, no. Didn't realise I was heading up. Right, this should now open. Because Shido has confessed. There it is. Oh, dear. So this shit... Here's that door to the depths, right? It should be. Why? What's wrong? I don't know. It looks like... It looks just like all the other ones I was thinking. It's a little disappointing. Maybe we're, we worked too hard to get down here or something. The lack of unforeseen circumstances is nothing to complain about. Let us continue. I agree. And also... Persona... Mogar... Crap. Stats. 
Morgana? There we go, Persona. I've never, I've not read this one. The Roman god of travelers and thieves, a diverse god, he is seen as a symbol of the human unconscious and the mental world. He is equated with the Philosopher's Stone, the ultimate mystery in the field of alchemy. Ah, he looks pretty cool too. Hmm. Although it looked like it was wearing a chain of the female symbol. With horns. What the hell? The hell is this? Some big fossil looking thing. Is that the treasure? Wait, look on the side. It's the train running down to Mementos. So this is where that crowd of people was trying to reach. Oh. Don't tell me. People are walking in and out of there, so the other other side of the wall must be... Wait, it's not a wall, but a giant door? Guess that means the treasure's not here. Come on, let's stay focused. Okay. Is this just one big-ass straight? Oh, it is. I'm going to assume this just leads to the depths. Oh. Is this thing seriously a door? How are we supposed to get past? Ah. Oh. It opened straight away. I bet that means the inner depths the metaverse was talking about before are right ahead. Hold on. The door opens only from this side. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Well, I took a quick peek at the mechanism inside the door. It is pretty awesome. And it looked like you can only open it from here. We can get in, but nothing can get out. It's as though whatever lies within has been locked away. Wait, so you're saying that the people going in there are choosing a life of imprisonment? I've never felt such eeriness before. What is this place? We'll find out once we reach the depths. Come on, let's go. Whoa. Whenever it's... Well, that's kind of just to signify this is like the final stretch. Or the final dungeon. When it's entrance, no exit. Oh, great. The hell is this place? It's so creepy. So strange... So those strange pipes tunneling through mementos 